this is a question involving decimals 0.25 multiplied by 4f minus 3 is equal to 0 0.05 multiplied by 10f minus 9. In this question, we find that there are two LHS here on the LHS and RHS there is a decimal here, there is a decimal here. So, what will be the procedure of solving this? The brackets have to be opened. So, multiply 0 0.25 into 4f, then multiply 0 0.25 with minus 3, then multiply 0 0.05 with 10f and 0 0.05 with minus 9. The signs is very important here, you will have to do the correct multiplication. So, let us look this step by step. So, 0 0.25 into 4, if you are going to multiply 0 0.25 with 4, you are going to get 1f minus you are going to multiply 0 0.25 with minus 3. So, if you multiply this, we are going to get a 0 0.25 into 3 and we know that 25 into 3 is 75, but you have to be careful of the decimal here. So, in the simple way 5 3 is a 15. So, 5 and 1 carry over 3 to the 6 plus 1 7 3 zeros are 0. Now, this decimal has to be placed here because we find that there are two values here after the decimal. So, in the answer also there has to be two values after the decimal. So, here 0 0.25 into 3, the calculation is shown here will be 0 0.75 is equal to 0 0.05 into 10. Now, this multiplication is easy because whenever we are dealing with multiplication with tens, hundreds and thousands, we do not have to actually multiply, we have to shift the decimal to the right side. So, here when it is multiplied with 10, 0 0.05 into 10, you just have to shift the decimal one place to the right. So, this is going to be 0 0.5 f minus, repeat the procedure as I showed here, 0 0.05 into 9. So, 0 0.05 into 9 we know is 9 fives or 45, but there are two numbers after the decimal. So, your answer also will have two numbers after the decimal. So, this will be 0 0.45. Now, after getting this value as 0 0.45, we have to bring the like terms on one side. So, this is going to be 1f. 0.5 f is shifted on the left. So, that will become 0.5 f is equal to negative 0.45 as it is this minus 0.75 is shifted to the right, you get positive 0.75. Now, 1 minus 0.5 we know is 0.5 f is equal to there is a plus here and there is a negative. So, plus and minus means negative. So, which means that you will have to multi, uh, subtract this. So, 0 0.75 minus 0 0.45 is going to give us 0 0.30 or we can simply write it as 0 0.3. So, once we write it as 0 0.3, we get LHS 0 0.5 F, we get 0 0.3 here. So, finally, we get F is 0 0.3 upon 0 0.5. So, answer is going to be 3 upon 5. However, when the question is in decimals, our answer should also be in decimals. So, final answer we get 3 upon 5 that is 0 0.6. Therefore, 0 0.6 will be the final solution or the value of f will be 0 0.6.